Hi, it's Donkey Shot, and in this video, I'm going to talk about the camera raw options in the FX panel. First of all, let's reduce my 78 presets to raw looks only, and for that, I'm going to open the search, hold the Alt key, and click on camera raw. So, all of those presets here are camera raw looks now. So, if I enter Bermuda, for instance, you see it as a camera raw look and what all those camera raw looks have in common they have the camera raw option buttons and that's what this video is about so let's take a look at the camera raw options first of all we have a toggler for the open camera raw filter dialog so if I apply the preset um, we see that a smart object has been created and the camera raw filter was applied and if I activate the open camera raw filter dialog and create the preset again the filter was applied as well but the camera raw dialog stays open so I can go and uh, create some adjustments and confirm and after that the look will be created as well okay so let's get rid of, of this let's switch to an actual image and I also do have those five different buttons one for the grain for the vignette, sharpening, noise reduction luminance and noise reduction color. So let's say I like the brown bear look but I want to add a grain. I just simply click on the grain button and activate it and if I create the preset now I do have some grain in it. The nice thing about those buttons is that I can activate them globally for all camera looks. So if I want to have grain in all of my camera looks because it is something that would fit to the image, I can say for all camera raw presets on or off, you see the color changes from white to green or red depending on if it's globally on or off. So now it's only for the preset, now it's for all presets and now it's deactivated for all presets. So let's say I want to have it active for all presets it's green and if I now go back to a different camera raw look and take a look at the camera options you see it's still green no matter no matter which camera raw I open so let's uh, stick with the green and what I also have when I look at the sharpening I have a yellow color and yellow means the values will be created automatically. To explain what this means, let's just stick with the grain and let's get rid of this look so far. Let me just activate auto values for, for the grain. I have a picture which is 900 pixels and I want to create this action. A grain and the auto values are active. Now I'm going to the same image, which is 7000 pixels, and I create the same preset. So if I switch between both images, you slightly see a difference in the grain, but not very big. If I turn off the auto values and replace this, you see a much bigger difference. The grain is much bigger, much more intensive on the small image than on the big image. That's because Photoshop uses for both images the same values. While when automatic is active, Photoshop or the FX panel will look how big your image is and use values that are appropriate for your image dimensions. You can also switch from auto values to custom values where you can define your own values, the color changes to blue then, and activate it for all camera raw presets. So now on all camera raw presets you have, a grain will be created with an amount of 75, 39 size and roughness of 61. So that's pretty much same with vignette. You can also activate it for all other presets or turn it off for all other presets or just use it for this preset. You can also activate custom values. Same with shortening noise reduction, luminance. So if you know, for instance, uh, you have an image that needs a little bit of sharpening, you could activate it globally, 
So no matter which look or which camera raw filter you use in the end, it will always be sharpened. So to sum it up, no matter which camera raw filter you use, you can always decide on your own if you want a grain, a vignette sharpening or noise reduction. And you can choose if the values should be automatically or if you want to use a custom values or if you want to use the values that come with the preset.